Hi there. Thank you for tuning in today's practice. Start in a standing position with your feet together firmly planted down. Ground down, feeling all the edges of your feet pressing into your mat. Relax your shoulders as you send your gaze over to one spot. Extend both arms in front of you, palms facing each other. Open to the sides, drawing the shoulder blades in together. Sweep the arms all the way up. Let's repeat. Inhale, extending the arms in front of you, to the sides. Exhale, sweep up. One more time, breathe in, extend forward, sides, breathe out and up. Repeat a few more times. Release your arms to the sides. Inhale, lifting your arms up. Exhale, rotating the shoulder, drawing a large circle backwards. Take a deep breath in. Lower the arms down slowly. Try not to swing, but move in a controlled motion. Breathe in. Breathe out. Changing direction. Start drawing circles forward. Inhale, sending the arms back. Exhale, rotate for circle. Gently release the arms to the sides. Lift your arms up for revolved chair pose. Slowly sit back as if sitting in a chair, twisting your body to the left. Send your gaze up over to the left fingertips. Place your right arm over your thighs. Back up, switching sides. Arms go overhead for chair pose. Slowly sit back. Place your left arm over your thighs, twisting your body to the right. Send your gaze up over to your right fingertips. Back up. Gaze softly at a fixed spot ahead of you. Slowly draw your left knee up towards your chest. Hug your knee in with both hands. Inhale, relax your breath and your body. Don't worry about losing balance. Take your time. Lowering the left leg down, draw your right knee up towards your chest, hugging your knee in with both hands. Inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. Exhale, keeping your gaze fixed on one point. Release your leg down. Ragdoll, deep breath in. As you breathe out, bend forward, bending from the knees, lengthening your torso. Ground your hands onto the mat. 
Slowly slide the right toes to the back of the mat. Stack your left knee over your ankle. Inhale, reach your left arm up to the ceiling, twisting your body to the left. Exhale, press firmly into your palm. Inhale, send your gaze up, deepening the twist. Warrior two, turn your left toes to the front edge of the mat. Right toes point to the wide edge. Align your heels. Spread your fingertips wide, raising your arms parallel to the floor. Send your right hand behind your back. Lower your left arm down on your knee. As you inhale, weave your left arm under your left thigh. Exhale, bending deeper into your left leg. See if you can bring your hands together behind your hips. Back to warrior two. Make sure your knee doesn't pass your ankle. Deep breath in and out. Lower down, finding low lunge. To maintain balance, imagine you're trying to pull your left heel and your right knee towards each other. Half split. Release your hands to the sides or on your hips. Slowly fold from the hips over your front leg. Send your hips over your back knee, extending your front leg forward. If you notice your back rounding, come slightly up, pressing your chest forward, keeping your spine long. Push back with the hips to find a nice stretch in your front hamstring. Back to low lunge, bending the front knee. Low side lunge. Move both hands to the inside of your left foot on the floor. Rotate your left foot to the side of your mat, keeping your knee bent. Your chest, shoulders, and toes all point in the same direction. Deep breath in and out. Come back to your lunge. Back to your ragdoll. Ground your hands onto the mat. Slowly slide the left foot to the back of the mat, stacking your right knee over your ankle. Inhale. Reaching your right arm up to the ceiling, twisting your body to the right. Exhale, press firmly into your palm. Inhale, send your gaze up, deepening the twist. Warrior two, take the widest stance you can between your feet. Turn your right toes to the front edge of the mat. Left toes point to the wide edge. Align the heels. Spread your fingertips wide, raising your arms parallel to the floor. Warrior two bind. Send your left hand behind your back. Lower your right arm down on your knee. As you inhale, weave your right arm under your right thigh. Exhale, bending deeper into your right leg. See if you can bind left and right hand behind your hips. 
back to warrior two. Slowly bend into your front knee. Lower down for low lunge. Stack your right knee over your ankle. Sink your hips down, feeling a nice stretch along your right thigh. Half split. Release your hands to the sides or on your hips. Send your hips over your back knee, extending your front leg forward. Slowly fold from the hips over your front leg. Lengthen through the spine, reaching your chest forward towards the toes. Push back with the hips to find a nice stretch in your front hamstrings. With each exhale, try to go a little deeper, pressing your chest forward. Back to low lunge, bending the front knee. Low side lunge. Move both hands to the inside of your right foot on the floor. Rotate your right foot to face forward, keeping your knee bent. Left foot rotates onto the heel. Inhale, sinking your hips down. Exhale, draw your shoulder blades in together. Deep breath in and out. Back to low lunge. Back to your ragdoll. Ground your hands and knees for tabletop. Stack your shoulders over your wrists and hips over knees. Body circle. Walk the hands forward. Deep breath in. Draw a big circle through your rib cage, drawing it to the right. Forward. Exhale. Inhale, press to the left and then back. We are getting the spine warmed up. Deep breath in as you start taking your circle. Let's switch direction. Breathe in, draw a circle, pressing your rib cage to the left, forward, breathe out, press right and back. Close your eyes and repeat a few more times at your own pace. Deep breath in, find tabletop. Come to a downward facing dog, lifting the sit bones up, keeping the back flat. On an inhale, Walk your feet to meet your hands. You can keep the knees bent. And walk back into your downward dog. Take a few more. We are building heat across the body. Walk to your hands and walk back into your downward dog. Lower down for tabletop. Child to Cobra. Walk your hands forward. Deep breath in. As you breathe out, sit your hips back on your heels for a child's pose. Breathe in. Press into the hands shifting your weight forward to come back on your hands and knees. From there, see if you can slowly press your thighs towards the mat, pressing into your palms firmly. Feel a nice gentle stretch in your lower back. Come back up, 
sitting your hips on your heels for child's pose. Inhale up, pressing into the hands, lowering the thighs towards the floor. Draw your shoulder blades in together, making sure they don't collapse. Take a few more at your own pace. Rest in child's pose. You can place a cushion between your hips and heels and also under your knees if that feels better. Rise back up on your knees. Press your shins and tops of your feet into the mat. Interlacing your fingers behind your hips, press the knuckles down, bringing the shoulder blades together. On an exhale, hinge forward from the hips, pressing your chest into your thighs. See if you can lift your knuckles away from your hips. Inhale, come back up. Tiny back bend, press the knuckles down. Exhale, fold pushing back with the hips. Unclasp your hands, finding tabletop. Find a comfortable seat. Seated cat and cow. Inhale, pressing the chest forward, drawing the shoulder blades together. Lift your chin up, slightly arching your back. Exhale, round your spine, tucking your chin. Inhale, chest comes forward for cow pose, opening the collarbones. Exhale, round your spine for cat pose. Deep breath in, press your shoulders forward, arching your back. Breath out, rounding your spine, tucking your chin. Back to neutral spine. Open the arms, bending the elbows to a 90 degree angle. Pressing the elbows back, look up, expanding your chest. Deep breath in. As you breathe out, extend your arms as if you're pushing something forward. Inhale, come back. Exhale, gently push. Engage your fingertips, finding length through the arms. Release your hands. Let's end this practice in a seated position. Cross your left arm over your right, giving yourself a tight hug. Inhale, palms are over your shoulder blades. Exhale, walk your fingertips closer. Inhale, smile. Relax your body. Deep inhale. Turn your attention to your breath. Inhale through your nose and be aware of your breath as it fills your lungs. Cross your right arm over your left.
slowly turn to the right, to the left. Breathe in, breathe out. Thank you for joining me in this practice. I hope to see you in the next one.